Hi, everybody. Erica Jollis with Roundtable Realty. I have decided I'm going to do something new each month. I am always asked what's going on with the market. How many average days until a house sells. So what I'm going to do is I am going to come to you monthly with market statistics year over year. It's a little bit out of my comfort zone, um, both coming to you live like this, or not live, but recording, and also um, the whole sharing screen, Zoom, all that. So bear with me. Um, if we don't step out of our comfort zones, we don't learn and we don't continue to grow. And that's always my goal. So here we go. Okay, so what I have here is basically um, the opportunity to show you with a median sales price, days on market for different parts of the greater Northeast Florida area. We're gonna look specifically at single family homes and we're gonna start with St. Johns County. This is all of St. Johns County. So everything that from basically the Julianton Creek area all the way down to St. Augustine, St. Augustine Beach. So overall, the median sales price is $490,000. Um, we are up, as you can see, 24% over last year, which is not surprising given what's going on with the market. Um, in all of St. John's County, you'll note that there's only 597 houses. That's down 33% from last year. Really, that equates to a one month worth of inventory, meaning it will take us one month to sell those homes. In a normal market, you know, I've been doing this almost 16 years, and I would say normally what we like to see is about six months worth of inventory. So um, this just further adds to what we're all hearing, how the market is crazy, how inventory is so minimal. Um, now, one other thing I want to point out to you is a median dollars per square foot is $223. I'm not so comfortable with that number. Um, typically, when an appraiser looks at a home and tries to value a home, they try to stay within the same neighborhood. So if this is saying $223 as the median per square foot, that's all well and good, but that's not what you could use if ever we wanted to price your home. You know, perhaps your home is in a neighborhood on the river, so probably dollars per square foot would be higher. Uh, we would really want to look at homes that have sold in your neighborhood really within the past three months. So that's not a number when looking at the big picture that really sits well with me, um, unlike the other numbers. So this is all of St. John's County. Now let's hone in specifically on the Northwest section, which is Julianton Creek down to World Golf Village and east over almost to 95, but not quite. So you'll see in that area, in the greater St. John's, Western St. John's County, the median sales price is just about $461,000 with only 257 houses on the market. This is why the market is so crazy. It's just so hard to find homes. Um, I was working with somebody yesterday who was looking for a home up to 325,000 and it was just shocking what is going on with pricing and how few options there are, which is why you need to talk to somebody like me because I know the tricks of the trade to help make offers where we get the winning bid. But that's a whole nother story. Median days on the market, 16 days. I've seen everything from 16 to 18. This is down 42% from last year. I mean, that's just crazy. In today's market, if a house doesn't sell on a weekend, sellers get really nervous. Again, these are statistics for this past December and they're year over year from last December. So that's for St. John's Northwest. If you have questions about your particular neighborhood or another part of St. John's County, be it Nocatee, Ponte Vedra, wherever, please reach out to me. I'm happy to share this information with you as well. Another area I want to just quickly look at is Duval County, but specifically sort of the greater... Well, I'm going to call it the greater Mandarin area. So this is from the Julianton Creek Bridge all the way north to San Marco. You'll see the median sales price here is 359000 and there's only 149 current homes on the market. Um, again, you can't really take the median dollars per square foot with two, you know, you got to take it with a grain of salt because I don't really feel that that's accurate. Um, I think it's just really surprising to see how inventory is down, sales prices are up, 
number of homes sold are, is down and that's simply because there's just no houses to sell and the number of listings is down. This is again for December. This time of year is usually always slow. I'm expecting there to be a lull for January and February, but I'm really hopeful that come March, we see that uptick again. Um, hopefully with more inventory, we'll definitely see more buyers. Um, with more buyers though, of course, we want them to have something that they can buy. Um, if you again have questions about other parts of Duval County, reach out to me. I'm here to answer any questions you have about your neighborhood anything in Clay County, anywhere, you know by now, I'm here to help you. Um, please reach out to me. Let me go back to my screen. Okay, there I am. Hi. Um, questions, thoughts, concerns, anything, reach out to me. I'm here. Let's talk about the value of your house. Let's talk about maybe what you could do now to your home to enjoy it for the next couple of years, knowing that you might be selling it in a couple of years. Um, it's not always about the bottom line. You have to be looking at, the, at your long-term goals. I'm here to help you do that in any other way. Please give me a call, 904-652-5978. Email, text me, whatever I can do, I'm here. Here is to a great 2022 and hope to hear from you.